What's up YouTube, I'm EVscape and welcome back to another video. Today is day number 22, I believe, in the 50 day video challenge. Shout out to Eva right here <laughs> with the wave. What's going on, dude? Uh, so day number 22, I believe, in the 50 day video challenge. If you guys aren't aware, I'm putting out a new video every single day for 50 days. So, uh, Let's stop messing around. Let's, uh, we're gonna jump straight into today's video. Today, we're gonna be finding out exactly how much money you can make without doing the Wilderness Achievement Diaries. Yeah, the Wilderness Achievement Diaries. Without doing them, how much money you can make from recharging glories at the Fountain of Ruin. So let's stop messing around. Let's jump into the clips. All right, guys, so I have myself a total of 522 glories. These cost me a total of 10 million and 67K. We're gonna go ahead and take them up to the fountain and rune and figure out how long it's going to take us to get through these and exactly how much profit we're going to make from it. So let's get into it. Let's hope we don't get PK'd. I'm going to go in with some dehydes and three brews and a restore. Hope that's, yep, that is a restore. And then uh, obviously our protection prayers. So uh, let's stop messing around. I'm going to stamina pot up and then we're going to take a full inventory and we're just going to be teleporting to the mage bank and then running to the east. And then afterwards, we'll go jump on the obelisk and we'll just use one of the glories to teleport us back to the Edgeville bank. Already a PK, literally 23 seconds in and there's already a PK, my lord. All right, we're going to just keep hopping worlds until I can't see anyone at the mage bank. That was ridiculous. 13 seconds in. Anyway, uh, let's find out how much we're risking here. We're going to be risking uh, 431k if we die, so that's going to suck. Let's just not die. All right, we just finished the first trip. That actually took me four minutes, but I'm not going to lie. I did get lost. I had no idea where I was going at one point, but we made it there. No PKs and uh, four minutes to do one inventory. Going to just um, energy potion back up to full run now because it actually takes up a decent amount of run energy going there. Now, I used a glory charge to <laughs> teleport back. So we'll take that off because we don't want to lose an extra glory if we do get PK'd. And then let's just jump straight back out there. There is no fucking way. This is my third inventory. Please tell me I keep this on death. Oh my fucking God. The power of Amulet of Eternal. Oh, this is worth like 19 mil. There is no fucking way that just happened. Holy shit. Literally my third inventory. Wow. Okay, I just looked it up. This thing is a 1 in 25,000 chance. And it's worth 24 mil. Holy fuck. Obviously, I'm not going to count this towards the hour but, or the, uh, the 500 glories, but that is nuts, dude. That is insane. All right, I just got absolutely three hit by the Chaos Elemental, and now I'm just going back without my bronze sword. So now I'm going to have to... Uh, all right, I got to be quick about this. I don't know how long I have to get back to my stuff, but I am going to take a couple sharks with me just in case the Chaos Elemental's still there. Can't believe I just got killed by the freaking Chaos Elemental. God damn it. Oh, need the sword. <laughs> sword. There we go. I'm just praying that the Chaos Elemental is like, moved. Hit a 22, a 25, and then a 27. And I was like, how am I supposed to survive that? I had my Mage Prey up and everything. Maybe it was ranging me. If I get there and it starts teleporting me everywhere, I'm not gonna be happy. I have seven seconds to receive my items. How far along was I? There we go. Hopefully we get all of these. All right, is that everything? Cool, we got all our stuff back. <laughs> oh, I can't believe I just got three hit by the Chaos Ellie. That was ridiculous. I'm not okay with that. Not okay in the slightest. All right, that is the end of one hour. We still have 66 of the normal glories left, but we managed to get 454 of the normal glories as well as one eternal so i'm gonna head over to the grand exchange right now and sell all these off and see exactly how much we end up with all right so these are selling off a little too slowly i'm just gonna go ahead and sell them all off instantly whatever i get for them see how much money we end up with now remember at the start of this video i bought them for 
10,067,000 exactly. And we end up with 10,612,000. So I'm just gonna quickly do some math. So we managed to make 545,000 GP this hour, around 545,000. Uh, I mean, obviously, if you put the eternal glory in there, we managed to make, you know, 25 mil GP. That's insane that I got this eternal glory, by the way. But this brings me to a good point. The eternal glory is worth 24.7 mil. So if we put that into the calculator, 24.76 mil, and it's a one in 25,000 chance to get. That means every single glory we recharge we have to add an extra 990 GP onto that for the chance that we would get an eternal glory. So over the course of one hour, I managed to make 545,000 GP, but we also recharged 454 glories, which would add an extra 450K onto that. So we've made almost 1 mil in an hour. So over the course of 25,000 glories, you would make approximately 1 mil an hour doing this. And that's without the Wilderness Achievement Diaries. Obviously that includes not being PK'd, but 1 mil an hour just to recharge some glories. It doesn't have any requirements apart from completing the Heroes Quest. And like, you only need a little bit of starting cash. You know, one inventory of glories costs 450K. You can just buy them, sell them. You teleport to Edgeville at the end of it anyway. I gotta say, this is actually a pretty decent money maker. I really, really like this one. And, you know, obviously I enjoy it a little bit more because I managed to stag myself an eternal glory. Absolutely insane. I'm gonna wrap up the video here, guys. If you enjoyed today's video, make sure you give it a like. Don't forget about the 50 day video challenge. We are 22 days into it so far. We have 28 more days to go. If you guys are enjoying that so far and you haven't already, make sure you click that subscribe button. I'll catch you guys in tomorrow's video. Take it easy.